Hello, beautiful souls. This is Myra again with Happy Soul, Happy Life. So I wanted to um, put these messages that I, you know, that we are needing to hear at this moment, right? And it comes from, you know, Mother Gaia, our earth, our beautiful oneness. It comes from our spirit realm, you know, with our angels, you know, um, so the first one was um, a rose. So I picked it up this morning. Like I say in all my videos, everything has a significant, it has a meaning, it has symbolism. So with the rose, and I picked it up because it just gives me that, that calmness, it gives me that connection, right? So with the rose, it is saying to us, it's telling us um, hope, balance, and strength, okay? And I think we can relate, um, all of us, that these are things that we are needing to have and to be in, okay? Know that when we have hope, you know, we, you know, have that faith right and you know it's always about having faith right that everything will turn out how god is wanting it to turn out you know and the other one was the red bracelet i make my red bracelets and i just love them i love the red it's very beautiful so for the red bracelet um it about faith it's about strength and it's about connection right connection to the you know with the universe connection to our divine connection with everything around us connection with mother earth okay and then i got angel 818 okay so for angel 818 if you see this number it's in it's for you too because you are looking at this video okay it symbols endings and fresh beginnings okay if it comes into our lives that means that there's an old chapter in our lives that has come to an end and is preparing us for the changes that are coming in so we can definitely relate to angel number 818, you know, and we might not see it, you know, that it was an old chapter as a collective, as a whole, that, you know, the old, what was is no longer. And that now we see it, that everything is changing for the greatest good, right? Um, I also got <laughs> this because uh, I consider myself a twin flame and it put a little message out there and they sure know how to give us these beautiful messages. And it says, remain happy and peaceful with your twin flame. Keep trust and believe in the blessings when they bring your twin flame. So, you know, we are you know, for myself and for all the twin flamers, <laughs> um, we are doing our our journey and, you know, we are discovering um, ourselves, as you know, it's a journey of self-discovery. But uh, with that comes this person that kind of activates us and it's a, re a mirror and a reflection of... <laughs> of what we need to basically conquer and go through and face, right? And instead of ignoring it or, you know, not facing it and, you know, dodge the bullet, right? No, they're there to tell us, hey, this is what you need to clear up, right? And at times it is, Ooh, hard but 
it brings us to it helps us to be empowered it helps us to be our best version of self it just brings us that fulfillment that we didn't have within ourselves right and that's what this journey is about it's about self-discovery right um the other number the other angel number that i got is angel 911 and this is highly karmic and spiritual uh number right it encourage us to pursue our per life purpose you know in our soul mission so is it you know if you are say a light worker if you are one that you just feel in your soul that you just want to help you know out the world you know you want to make um the world a better place you want to change lives right for some people it might be corny but <laughs> for me it's all honest and that's the truth <laughs> um but it's it's time you know it's time and remember you are the creator of your reality so what you know right now is such a perfect time that we are able to share our wisdom share our our knowledge uh, with people you know and bring them back to a balance right bring their anxiety down um bring that fear you know down um being able to help them be grounded you know and be able to feel stable right? that, you know with the wind you know that we remain like trees and we are rooted into mother gaia and be able to you know not be knocked down you know we might be swear you know like woo, but know that we are rooted and we will stay uh, stabled when chaos comes across and comes around and goes through us and all over the place right also i got angel angel number 1010 and that is it is time for your personal development right and this is for everybody that is listening to this and that you know feels inspired to you know do more you know to discover self right to find out your the things that you like the things that you that you are creative and find what you know what makes your soul urge for more right so it's all about right now what you are wanting for self right what what do you want if you're, like, if you're a little you know imagine yourself being this child you know this child within you what is this little child wanting to know what is this little in the, the the little child does want to know but she wants to experience a lot of things you know she wants to see she wants to um go she wants to just experience life itself so this is a great time for doing that okay and what more that I got this afternoon was angel number 444 and this is telling us your intuition and your inner wisdom is very strong right now with our with the spiritual realm right with the angelic kingdom so with this for me is have that faith you know and right now in these moments of turbulence turbulence <laughs> it's about connecting with your source connecting with the divine connecting with the spiritual right and just whether it's by praying because for me that's one of my things is praying has always been a, you know whether i go and you know when i travel right 
I always get, you know, coming, you know. And that just makes me feel calm. Gives me zen, gives me century, gives me peace, gives me protection, gives me just of overall all it gives me that I've been heard and I've been recognized by the Lord. Right. So whatever it is that keeps you at peace, that keeps you balanced, that keeps you protected, that you feel protected, you know, I recommend that you guys do that. Like it says right now, our angels are telling us that your inner wisdom, right, is very strong right now. So if you are needing to connect, by all means, that is something that, you know, our spiritual realm is definitely asking you know, in these crazy times, okay? So thank you guys, but we are doing so good. I am seeing that, you know, we are helping. We are, just like how they say it, there's light and dark, right? But I see so much of assisting the collective, helping the collective, you know, and it just feels wonder without being drained. And I just feel very honored to be part of the 144. Thank you, you guys. Namaste.